Now, when you study computer math, you're always going to talk about upgrades. Like, for example, I have the old, I'll show you, yeah, the fork. Now, with the fork, can I do damage on the internet? Can I really search? Can yeah. I? Yeah, so watch. I'll show you right now. So if I open up my phone, and I go to the web, and I go to Google, boom, oh, there's Google. It comes right up. See how fast? No problem. Now, not really fast. Okay, there's Google. Okay, so there you go. There's Google. Now, here's the deal, though. What's the newest iPhone out right now? iPhone S. iPhone 4S, right? So I have a 4, but now I have a 4S. Now, if I wanted to upgrade this 4 to a 4S, what do I have to do? Pay money. Yeah. Upgrade? Upgrade, but how would I do that with this phone? Yeah. Plug in the computer. Plug in what? The... What's the special name for this? Port. Huh? This is a port. Okay, this is definitely a port. I'll make a little arrow. You can't see it. It's digital. Okay? This is a port. Okay? But what plugs in here? What do I have to buy? Special. I know you know. Oh, yeah. Plugger? A plugger! No. Okay, no. What do you got? Charger. Oh, no, I don't want to charge your phone. I want to download stuff. Connected to a Last word starts with a B. I need to plug on my... What is it? Nobody knows? Okay, it's called your USB. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, you got to plug in the USB. Listen. USB is the most universal term. So your USB, can you download with it? Yes. Can I charge the phone with it? Yes. Can it bring a virus to the iPhone? Yes, yes it can. Okay? So you got to be very careful when you're downloading. So check it out. In order to upgrade, I have to download the newest form of the iPhone, right? Now where do I go? Which website? iTunes. Ooh, nope. App Store. The App Store, without a doubt. So I go to the App Store, I, lock, I plug in my USB, and I download the new program, and now I'm upgraded. Okay? And that's what you do. Google does that all day. There's a whole team of people like you guys. First of all, Google only hires the smartest of smartest of smartest people. I mean, the interview process, you got to go on seven interviews before you get the job. Because they want the best and the brightest to work there. Okay? Just like Mark Twain just like Stuyvesant, just like Brooklyn Tech, just like Bronx Science, just like all these cool schools, they want the best and the brightest. Now with Google, all they do all day is figure out how can we make Google better. They're always upgrading the website. What's the best form of Google right now? Google Chrome. Google Chrome, okay, so you got Google Chrome. Now what's the difference? 